Okay, you can tell me. I'm sure don't you, I'm filibuster. Sure you know. I'm not filibustering. How much oil are they selling today? Here is Ted Cruz, obviously, Senator from Texas, Ted Cruz, uh, really just wonderfully detailing all of the foreign policy failures of the Biden administration right to Secretary of State Antony Blinken's face. So just, just even just watch this first part as it relates to the death of the, uh, the Iranian president. This, this is just great. Today, the United Nations is flying their fl flag at half staff to mourn the death would you agree that it is utterly disgraceful for the United Nations to be mourning the death of the butcher of Tehran? Uh, we're certainly not mourning his death, as I said. We express Would you agree it's disgraceful a, for the UN to be? Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll look at what they've done. We certainly would not do that. The, what they've done is flown the flag at half-staff. Mm -hmm. Is well, that disgraceful? We, we wouldn't do that, and we would certainly find that. And, and I would note that's the absence of American leadership. Your State Department on the morning of October 7th, sent out a tweet telling Israel not to engage in military re retaliation. I called you out at 3 in the morning, and you deleted that tweet. The next day, you personally, on October 8th, sent a tweet saying you had spoken with the Turkish foreign minister, and Israel should not retaliate. From the very beginning, the Biden administration has consistently, at every stage, told Israel, and by the way, when I called your tweet out, you deleted it again. At every stage, you have been telling Israel, do not kill the terrorists, and that has been from day one. When you, became Secretary of, when you became Secretary of State, how much oil was Iran selling a day? I'll have to come back to you on any numbers. I don't have the, uh, yeah, the numbers. You don't know. It doesn't surprise me you don't know. It was about 300,000. Hmm. How much oil is Iran selling today? We have, we have, we've applied sanctions against more how than much 200 oil is entities Iran selling that are engaged today? in petrochemicals. How much oil? oil okay, you can tell me. I'm sure don't you, I'm filibuster. Sure you know. I'm not filibustering. How much oil me. are they selling today? Do you, you tell know? Me. You tell me. Uh, apparently, you don't know. So you don't know how much they were selling. It was 300,000. Today, they're selling about 2 million barrels a day. How many ghost fleet ships did Iran have in November 2020? We uh, have sanctioned more than 200 It's a question. I'm, I'm not, how many did We've, they have? Um, the total number, I can't tell you what it had in 2021. I'll come back to you with that. But we have... Uh, the number was about 70. Yeah, how we, many did they have today? About, we blocked about 50 of them. Okay, let's see how effective you are. How many do they have today? As I said, we blocked about 50. How many do they have today? You, you, you tell me, I'm sure you They have about over 400. Mm -hmm. You funded our enemies and you undermine our friends and the world is much, much more dangerous as a result and Americans are at greater jeopardy because of it. Which one of those guys do you think is telling the truth and when, which one of them is just sitting there defending the indefensible? Like it's pretty damn obvious and major props to Ted Cruz right there and how Blinken goes into these things. This is what they all do. They go into these things. They don't know the history of anything. They don't seemingly know what their basic job was. They don't know the numbers. They don't know the amount of ships. They know absolutely nothing. And the point of all of this is that if you just do what Ted Cruz did in your own way, in your own life, when you're arguing with somebody, do you have any evidence of any of that? Um, do you have any numbers that you could back any of that up on? Do you know what happened with any of this stuff? Are you apologizing for the worst regimes while trying to go after the good guys? You can actually start breaking people.